There's nothing quite like getting into a car stacked with presents, putting on your best festive jumper, and cranking up the Chris Ray as you venture out onto the motorway to drive home for Christmas. There's also nothing worse than finding yourself, as the song goes, top to toe in tailbacks, with red lights all around. If you do find yourself on our motorways this Christmas, spare a thought for the people who will be giving up their Christmas to make sure you get home safely to enjoy yours. Highways England traffic officers like me, along with our control room operators, contractors and colleagues in the emergency services, will be working 24 hours a day over the Christmas period, doing our best to keep the country's motorways moving. We will be out there in all weather, clearing debris, towing broken down cars, and even, if necessary, closing roads, and no, we don't do it for fun. We will be the ones overseeing that lane closure that looks completely unnecessary, but is in fact protecting you from a road soaked in diesel. It feels especially festive when we're standing there in the freezing cold and people shout Merry Christmas at us as they pass and give us a cheery wave to say thank you. At least that's what I choose to think they are doing. It's not just cars full of presents and excited children that we help to get home safely. If you're like me and prefer to avoid the high street over Christmas, online shopping is the answer to all your woes. But as Amazon don't yet have a sleigh and chimney based delivery system, although it's probably only a matter of time, all your carefully, and not so carefully, chosen presents will rely on our motorways to make it to you in time for Christmas. When you unwrap your presents, just take a second to think about the traffic officer who might have had to put an overturned car back on its wheels. Stop the traffic to remove a wheelbarrow from the center lane, or even wrestle a sheep out of the road so that those presents could make it under your tree. All these things have happened, even the sheep. Although I did not wrestle it myself, we were around to help control the traffic while the farmer turned up and did. I am hoping for a reindeer this year. If the worst has happened and you do get stuck in a queue, know that we will always be doing our best to get you moving again. We are probably at the front of the traffic, lying in a puddle, trying to get a car ready for towing or attempting to drag a sofa to the hard shoulder. I know it can seem like we close things for no reason and stop traffic unnecessarily, but we don't. Everything we do, we do to make sure you, and we, get home safely. One of the most important tools we have are those sparkly red XS that appear above the lane on certain motorways, such as the M25. They might look like Christmas lights, but they are not. That lane is closed, and passing underneath could cost you points and a fine. There could be a broken down car stuck in that lane, there could be an accident, there could be a lorry tire, or a pedestrian. There could be one of our vehicles trying to help someone, 